Tesla is reportedly starting hardware 3.0 retrofits for vehicles equipped with hardware 2.0. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. I have a very exciting story for, for you. If your Tesla has hardware 2.0, Tesla is reportedly starting hardware 3.0. But please subscribe to our channel as we report three to five Tesla stories daily and ring the notification bell. And please like this video to show your support and appreciation of all the people who helped me to bring these stories to you. Tesla is reportedly starting hardware 3.0 retrofits for Model S and Model X vehicles that are equipped with the company's hardware 2.0 computer. The initiative stands as yet another sign of Tesla's push to expand the rollout of its full self-serving full uh, self-serving features which are expected to achieve their feature complete form in the near future. As noted in a recent video from YouTube's Dirty Tesla channel, the electric car maker has started offering hardware 3.0 upgrades to hardware 2.0 vehicles. This is a notable update, considering that hardware 3.0 retrofits have previously been focused on Model S, Model X, and Model 3 that are fitted with hardware 2.5. To get a clear view of, his, uh, of this recent development, it is pertinent to discuss the evolution of Tesla's autopilot and full-service driving computer. Following the company's split with Mobileye, Tesla rolled out vehicles that were equipped with hardware 2.0. At this time, the company also introduced enhanced autopilot as a 5000 option and the full self-driving suite for an additional $3000. Similar to full self-driving today, Tesla's full self-driving suite was sold based on the prospect of owners eventually receiving autonomous driving features as they became available in the future. The system was pretty much followed until the release of the Model 3, which shipped with hardware 2.5. Hardware 2.5's improvements over hardware 2.0 were subtle, such as the introduction of an updated radar and different filters for the vehicle's cameras. But hardware 2.5 was not the end at all and be all for Tesla's full self-driving efforts. The company opted to develop its own autonomous driving computer in-house and the result of this was the emergence of hardware 3.0, a computer that's arguably the most well-rounded autonomous driving unit in the market today. Today, all vehicles are equipped with Tesla's hardware 3.0 computer, which explains Elon Musk's statement during Autonomy Day last year when he stated that Tesla would eventually have a million vehicles in its fleet that are robotaxi capable. With hardware 2.0 to hardware 3.0 upgrades now starting, Tesla would likely be able to focus more on rolling out more robust features of its full self-driving suite. This should help the company gather more real-world driving data, which should allow the electric car maker's neural network to be trained more effectively. Ultimately, Tesla's decision to start hardware 3.0 retrofits on hardware 2.0 vehicles bodes well for a serious push of the company's autonomous driving efforts. Let me know what you think about this uh, retrofit, uh, friends. Are you going to retrofit your car if it's hardware 2.0 and so to 3.0? Let's continue the discussion in the comment section below. In the meantime, this is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here for the first time, please look around, see our daily Tesla and electric car coverage, and subscribe to our channel, please. And Ring the, ring the notification bell and I'll see you in our next report. I would greatly appreciate if you would like this video to show your support and appreciation of Tesmanians and with Kalibel Deveza who uh, presented this story and brought it to us. Thank you and um, I'll see you in our next report. Have a wonderful rest of the day. God bless you and have a blessed weekend. Take good care of each other and your families, friends.